Good day, everyone, once again, and welcome mm-hmm. in a very grand style. I'm welcoming you in a very, very, very grand style. What's up, people? My name is KING, and I'm welcoming you to G Dynamic TV. Please, mm-hmm. Don't forget to don't forget to click on the notification bell. I I bet it with you. You know what miss out on any of our clean, clean, clean and odd updates. I'm telling you, yes. Alright, still on Timothy Adego case death and uh, the case in court. We can just, you know, there's a video where going viral now about the wife, the wife in Yoruba. They will call, they will say, okay, you know, uh, it's just like saying, okay, you know, in the Yoruba tradition, I think it's 40 days. Yeah, the, the, the widow, she has, she has to stay at home for 40 days, mourning her husband. And now it's over and you can just see the moment in court, in, in the church rather, when the woman went to church with uh, their children, the children, uh, you know, the issues between herself and the disease. If I mean, if I talk about issues, you know, I'm not talking about challenges or problems. I'm talking about children. Yeah. Now, she, she was just crying and it was a very emotional moment. Kai, people cried, man. People cried. Even Chief for Yomi Amzad, he, he could not just hold himself so much like that. People cried. And then this one is coming so heavy on Timothy Adigoki. Linking me with Raman, how they doing? It's political. <laughs> Maraji cries out. Guru Maraji himself. Okay. Ha. I know you people at home will be like, ah, what is happening? Why is he dragged into this? And if you've not forgotten, a postmortem and autopsy done by expert, I mean expert, more than six experts, they they did the, they performed the autopsy on Timothy Adigoke's corpse, and it was discovered that he did not die of natural death or any disease, as claimed by uh, one of the hotel workers. Said no, they said no. This was caused by pain inflicted on the deceased, which made him to bleed to death. All right. What's what's my what's Guru Maharaji's own in this? The founder of One Love Family, Sadhguru Maharaji, has declared that he has no relationship with Chief Raman Anodoy, one of the suspects arrested in connection with the killing of Mr. Timothy Adegoki. If you can still remember this post, this guy is very red. Let me call him guy or this man. Let me just respect him. <laughs> he calls himself God, he calls himself a lot of names. Yeah, if you are very, 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 you know, uh, let me see, let me use the word conversant with traveling on Lagos Ibano Express to you will really, really know where this guy where is he? should we call it a city or a camp? But I've never been there and I don't think I want to be there. Maraji made this disclosure while addressing a press conference in Ibadan. That was yesterday evening, Sunday evening. Hmm. We recall that Adedoyi, a hotelier, was arrested alongside five of his staff last year over alleged killing of Mr. Degoke. Adegoke, a Master's of Business Administration student of Obafemi Awolowo University, Ileife, lodged at Adedoyi's hotel to write one of his examinations here. Yeah. Like I believe he, he his center was supposed to be a distance learning uh, center at Moro. And then he decided, let me just lodge. Thank God that he even told his wife the name of the hotel and everything. That's how he would have died. And nobody would even die. I, I'm very sure a lot has happened like that. You can still remember very, very well, not just vivid, very, very well. Uh, Olani Afi is that policeman, that policeman who, who, who became a witness in court, talked about the sorrow, the corpse, how his corpse was already buried uh, at Ede Road. Yes, there is a place called Ede Road. That's the expressway linking Ilefe to Ede. It was dropped and you know, it is just a very painful thing, man. It's just a very painful thing. Let's, uh, it's, it's, let me, should I sound this as a warning? Okay, let me just say this as an advice. Let me give an advice. That if you are going anywhere, please just make sure someone or two people knows your whereabouts. Let them know where you are going. Let them know. Let them know. This world is now scary. Like, Nigeria itself is now scary. Hmm? Maraji has, however, declared, that's Guru Maraji, declared that it is wrong for anyone to link him to the alleged killing of an innocent citizen. Guru Maraji insisted that it was political to link him to the alleged killing. Maraji said that the only time he met Adedoin was when Adedoin was celebrating his 60th birthday and was invited to grace the occasion. He said that he honored the invitation to pacify Adedoin, who was one of the persons who contested to be honored of Ilife a few years ago. That's true. 
is now currently the mayor of Ife. He said that he lost in the contest and there was a need for him, Maraji Azia Vurudua, to pacify him. I don't have any relationship with Chief Araman Adedoe. After the contest to elect me or new of Ife, in my capacity as the eye of Urudua, I had to make peace among the contenders to pacify the losers. When Adedoe was celebrating his 60th birthday, I was invited to grace the occasion in 2019. I went there in my capacity as the eye of Urudua to pacify him for losing in the contest for new of Ife. I went there and left. That was the only time I met him. So linking me with ritual killing is political. It is political to link me with Adedoe. <laughs> He said, I am a prince of a burden land. We do not do we do not do such things here. Anyone interested should come and investigate. My doors are open. So <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh god, oh god. This is this is I love that dude. I love that dude. That is me coming out like wow. I did not do anything. I don't know him. I don't know how to do in you. I beg you. I beg you. Stop saying any other thing. You know? So stop saying. And then the next thing he said was, I'm advocating 60 years imprisonment for fake news promoter Akilo Dena waiting. <laughs> People. <laughs> Maraji the Vex. All right, that's all about Maraji. Guru Maraji. Sad Guru Maraji, as we all know him. He said, linking me with Raman Ade doing his political on Timothy Adegoke's case. Yeah. Like I said the other time, the wife, that's the widow. The widow of Timothy Adegoke entered church today. She was she was seen in church. She was seen in church. She was seen in church. You know, she I think she has finished mourning her husband in the Yoruba traditional way. So it was a very, very, very painful moment. And we just bless God that the truth will, will prevail. The truth will prevail. And then we could just see Chief Ra, Chief Hamza to Ruyomi begging Nigerians and begging uh, the, the federal government to make sure that justice prevails. Thank you very much. My name is Kia Inji, the king himself. 